Good afternoon, everybody. My name is Ken Bates. I'm the president and CEO of Open Sky Community Services. And I just wanted to talk with you about Mental Health Awareness Month and all of the fine work that's happening in our community uh, and certainly in our programs across Open Sky. You know, we're living in very interesting times and uh, this pandemic has caused a lot of stress and anxiety uh, and so many different emotions and, and uh, had such great impact on so many people in different ways. Um, we have responded, I think, so well to the crisis um, and this pandemic across Open Sky. I'm particularly proud of all of the work that our staff have done in supporting uh, the individuals and families that we serve and also in supporting each other as we know that the support that we provide um, is so critical during this time, um, during this time of isolation, right? I think um, the isolation has had such a tremendous impact on, on everybody, and um, especially those who have uh, challenges or uh, uh, symptoms, perhaps uh, psychiatric symptoms. The stress, the fear, the loss, and again, the isolation has, uh, has caused a lot of harm uh, to people. Um, and so I think about Mental Health Awareness Month and the work that we've done in preparing um, for this has been uh, very helpful and necessary. And I think our work needs to continue. I think what we've seen on the medical side of this pandemic is that uh, we weren't well prepared for this. And I think we've seen some of the impact, uh, the negative impact of that. I think uh, in terms of the emotional and mental health impact of this pandemic, um, we're gonna continue to see that impact. And I think our planning needs to continue and our work certainly needs to continue um, in a way that we've done. And I think what is so true to people um, at Open Sky and so, um, so much a part of who we are, we talk about uh, connections and relationships. And those are the things that um, are going to help us get through this together. The connections that we have, um, again, not just with the people we support, but also with each other and those relationships and being able to support each other in building up uh, resilience and um, focusing on hope for each other. And we have lots of stories in the organization. We have so many stories in the organization of hope and resilience. And I think it's really important that we take time to recognize those stories, to recognize those instances where um, people are doing amazing things, uh, creativity um, in, in programming, pre creativity in the way that we're supporting each other, supporting the people we serve, um, that this sense of hope is also so critical to helping people uh, recover, to helping people deal with the crisis, to deal with the pandemic. So I'd like to just make a special shout out uh, as we come to the close of uh, Mental Health Awareness Month, a special shout out to all of our staff across the organization, uh, especially the peers that we have, our residential staff, outreach counselors, our clinicians, um, and all of our staff working uh, both on the front lines and behind the scenes across the organization who are really driving us toward this one singular mission, mission of helping people um, recover and helping people certainly through this, through this crisis. We have to remember Mental Health Awareness Month is every month, not just the month of May. Um, we want to keep up all of the great work that we're doing. And again, I want to thank everybody out there in the Open Sky community, community for everything that we've done and all that we'll continue to do to support people in our community. Thank you very much.